just want to address a few things, you know what I'm saying? So first and foremost, um, I feel like with Demon Time, it, you know, it's entertaining, it's fun, you know, I'm having fun. I don't take all that stuff, you know, extremely serious. I have to say that on live. I don't take that stuff extremely serious. I'm having fun, but then there's also, there was a lot of anger, you know, built up inside of me. I had a lot of anger and frustration built up inside of me that I just let out all on camera. Um, should I have done that a different way? A hundred percent. A lot of people are like, he's completely different now. Um, I'm with my daughter, all right? I don't show my daughter no aggression, no anger, nothing even remotely close to that. My daughter spills something on the ground. I'm like, it's okay. My daughter, it doesn't matter what she does. I'm like, it is okay because, you know, you know what? I don't have to, you know what? This is a good thing. Someone just said, stop venting. It's not, I'm not necessarily venting right now. I'm just trying to clear the air on a couple things, but that's so true. Like, I'm not venting to you guys. I'm, daddy, I'm talking to you guys. My, da my daddy too. I wake up Ooh. and I, I wake up and you just sleeping. Yeah. So she woke up last night. It was like three o'clock in the morning. You just woke up and you was just up. I turned over and I'm like, and, why is this nigga up? And, and the monkey did, and then he jumped off. What are you talking about? A monkey drop off and um, A monkey? What monkey? Uh, mommy monkey. All right. <laughs> Look, right there. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, some people are like, yo, he's so different right now. I'm, I am a real father, okay? I don't let my emotions and my frustrations and my angers change like, uh, 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 change how I am with my daughter. How I am with my daughter is how I am all the time. I'm very calm. I'm very respectful. I'm very, like, I'm trying to show her a temperament to that she can understand all the time and maintain within her own life because I don't want to ever want her to be screaming, yelling. So if I'm on demon time and stuff like that, she was nowhere near around because that necessarily isn't for her to see you busting down right now. That wasn't for her to see. Granted, she could probably see it in the future. I highly doubt it. You know, like five years from now, I highly doubt she's going to go look at a video five years ago. Maybe. But, you know, that time is a different type of time. You know, when I'm with my daughter, it's, it's like this. She cool. She understand. Like, she going to tame the lion. Now, another thing that I want to speak on real quick is... Um, you know, I went on a live, I went stupid. You know what I'm saying? I went, I went for 30. Like I had a lot of anger built up on me. Dude, I have a daughter, bro. It is extremely disrespectful to plant something on someone that is not true. Mr. DDG is steady saying, Fredo, oh, uh, Coke is a hell of a drug. That is extremely, hold on. What you want, baby, what you want? My lighter. Oh, you want your lighter? Okay. Be careful, be careful. Don't worry. Let me show them. You want to show them? Go ahead, show them. It's not dark. It's your Minnie Mouse lighter. It's not dark. It's not. But anyways, man, I have a daughter, bro. Speaking of DDG directly, I have a daughter. That's extremely, extremely disrespectful. I would never pin something on someone. Yeah. You see them? You see that? I would never pin and say something on someone that isn't true. You know, I could easily call you a meth head. I can easily say you're a meth head, you know, just by judging and looking at your skin on your face. It does not look it does not look right. I could easily say that about you, but I'm not saying that, you know, I'm not going to pin something on someone that I don't know. And it's extremely disrespectful. Yeah. It's me. It's in your neck. Yeah. Anyways, man. I would never do that. And I don't feel like I deserve to have someone, you know, speaking down on my image like that either. Now, um, hold on. This is a great question right here. This is a great question. No, he didn't. Talk. Oh, and by the way, also, I am a great father. I believe in fatherhood. I believe in, you know, being there for your child and, you know, like legitimately being a good father, not a, a not a YouTube father. There's somebody right now that I really want to speak on, but I'm not even going to get it at the time of the day. <laughs> I'm not even going to give it the time of the day, but the main thing that I wanted to do, I wanted to address that because... You want to get down? Yeah. 
You want to go play? Mm -hmm. hey, go ahead. Go ahead. Sorry, it was her dinner time. But anyways, I just wanted to speak on that because like it, that isn't. <sighs> hey, that isn't right to you know say that on someone's character and like that's 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 sad, honestly. And that just shows like when the hate don't work, they start telling lies. It's like. The fake, 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 fake. All right. Fake, fake. Pretty boy Fredo, fake this. Pretty boy Fredo, fake this. All right. This isn't working. So you know what, guys? Our next best thing, let's say, oh, he's on drugs. Oh, he does coke. Oh, he, like, what? Huh? What? Okay, cool. That makes sense. So when the hate don't work, they start telling lies. And it's okay. It's, it's honestly okay. But it, you got to understand at the end of the day, these people have families. These people have kids. These people have you know, people that they provide for, you're being disrespectful and you're planning things on people's name that's just not true at all whatsoever. And that's extremely disrespectful. And I do feel like that I can protect my character. At the end of the day, I can always protect my character. I feel like it's right. I feel like how you protect CJ smokes blunts. That's it. whoever smokes, whatever the fuck they smoke, that's their business. I don't worry about what the fuck they be doing, though. I don't be worrying about that shit. What? I'm sorry, Ava. I'm sorry. Anyways, I just cursed. I'm sorry, y'all. I was not supposed to curse. But um, whatever someone does in their own time, that's what they do. But what I'm not going to do, I'm not going to make up lies on someone and be like, dun, 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 dun. Like, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that at all. Now, another thing I want to speak on, I want to speak on my brothers. I want to speak on my brothers. I want to speak on SSH. Now, first and foremost, I just want to give a, a huge shout out to my brothers that stand by my side. You know, um, there's a lot of talk online about, yes, man, this, yes, man, that, yes, man, this, yes, man, that. And for them, I understand that it can get extremely, like, frustrating. It can get extremely, like, you know, like, damn, I'm just standing by my brother's side. It's just like anybody else. I don't care who it is. If you speak on them, they're going to be there for them. Just like if anybody speak on one of them bros, I'm going to be there, too. That's not going to make me a yes, man, regardless if, they're, if, regardless if they're right or wrong. I'm going to stand by their side, no matter what. Absolutely, no matter what, I'm going to stand by their side. So just like my brothers, I just want to tell them thank you for always standing by my side, because that means absolutely everything to me. Baby, come here. Come here. Come here. Hey, get away from her. Get. Get. Sorry, y'all. AJ be all up on him. But anyways, you know, SSH is a brotherhood. You know what I'm saying? Like we stand beside each other, right or wrong, always. And I just want to shout out to them boys for always standing by my side, right or wrong. They always, you know what I'm saying? They always tell me when I'm wrong and they, they stand by it. If I'm wrong, they're going to tell me in private and they're going to stand on that. They're not going to come to the internet and be like, yo, Fredo's wrong. Fredo this, Fredo that. No, they actually talk to me in person and they tell me that. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and that's simply what it is. That's what a brotherhood is. No matter what, they're going to stand by your side no matter what it is. But I do feel like what you say and how you say it does play a part in the way people view things. I'm not going to lie. Demon time looks insane. It does look insane. That, that Fredo is just a very angry Fredo. That's all it is. But it, bottom line, it does come down to what you say and how you say it. How I said in those moments, it's just very angry, bro. There's no way I can scream and go <sighs> like I can't have a low voice and like say all of that stuff. Like there's no way if you have a lot of anger, you're going to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that's just bottom line what it is. But if you're calm and you're in a like a chill like mindset it's going to be way different. So bottom line, that's what I wanted to say. And, and that's that. But. I appreciate you guys. I just want to say that I appreciate my supporters so much because you guys stick, stick by my side no matter what. Like, I truly, truly appreciate it. And I can't thank you guys enough for all the love and commitment that you guys show me, you know what I'm saying, throughout the years. Like, it means a lot to me. Sorry, somebody was calling me, bro. But um, I truly appreciate you guys standing by my side no matter what. And that's basically the bottom line of what it is. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here. Come here. You want to play? Yeah. You don't want to say nothing to the camera? 